In his speech, the president said he was working to get federal workers paid as soon as possible. But for workers who've already missed two paychecks, soon may not be soon enough. Well, that's why Georgia's own credit union gave away free gas to TSA workers. Fox 5's Moore Stiggs has the story. So, eight and a half gallons of free gas it may seem like a small gesture to you, a small amount, but consider this, if you had to do without paychecks in your family, well, you might understand why these folks are appreciating that gesture. Gasoline is one of the factors cited by TSA employees that could cause them not to show up for their vital public safety jobs. We'll take it. <laughs> Every little bit helps. Honestly. Every little bit helps. And a significant donation from a corporate citizen, Georgia's own credit union, provided that little bit of help this afternoon. Thank you. Thanks. Appreciate it. Thanks really. so much for being out and doing everything you're doing. All right, I know thank it's you. It's going to be tough, so we're going to give you eight and a half gallons of gas. All right, I really appreciate that. Thank you, guys. And that is the CEO, Dave Preter, who joined other employees filling the federal workers' tanks. It's a great day in America. It's always been a great day in America for the community to come together and uh, do what they do to uh, just take care of one another. It's a great, great opportunity. Well, we appreciate it, whatever they have done to put the gas in the car out there. And uh, this is a much appreciation to everybody who comes in here and get the gas. I like my job. Yeah. But I don't like it when I don't get paid. This TSA employee, a young mother, is among the most vulnerable. Times have been a little hard and <laughs> I came in right when the shutdown started so I came in making no pay and we really do appreciate everything. You didn't even need eight and a half. <laughs> Come back for your extra gallon. All right. All right. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. So how much is all this costing? Well, they budgeted for about $15,000, but if the gas pump meter goes beyond that, well, they say that's okay. From Hapeville, I'm Morse Diggs, Fox 5 News.